Hello YouTube and welcome to a brand new GTA update. They also mentioned Red Dead Online, but I don't play that, so we're just going to focus on the GTA side of things for this, but there are some awesome changes coming, and I thought it would be nice to do a video over it. So, Grand Theft Auto and Red Dead Community update. As we look at what's in store for the Rockstar Games community in the weeks and months ahead, we'd like to take this opportunity to thank everyone for their unmatched enthusiasm and commitment to all of our titles. It's your support that drives us to keep pushing forward with everything we do, and we are excited to share with you the first details around upcoming updates and more. With more players than ever taking to the streets of Los Santos thanks to the recent launches of PlayStation 5 and the Series XS, we'll be working to improve the overall GTA Online experience with new gameplay updates, adding top community requested experience improvements and upgrades to make it easier for players to enjoy everything GTA Online has to offer. In just a few short weeks, a new update is coming to GTA Online on all platforms that will expand upon the criminal careers of executive, biker, gunrunner, and nightclub owner, alongside a set of contact missions that presents the opportunity to be sworn in as a special IAA field operative to investigate a budding criminal conspiracy. Nice. This update will also feature some changes that have been long requested by the community, such as reducing the effectiveness of homing missiles and countermeasures on the oppressor Mark II. Thank goodness we've, we've reached the promised land. <laughs> Offering a more convenient way to access snacks and armor. I like that. And the ability to launch cell missions in invite-only sessions. Oh my goodness. This is the greatest update ever. <laughs> Oppressor nerfs, a better way to get snacks and armor, and finally launch cell missions and invite-only sessions. Thank you very much. That is fantastic. These are just a few of the experience improvements that will be coming this summer to GTA Online as we continue to incorporate more player feedback and other learnings moving forward. We'll also be increasing some of GTA money payouts throughout the game to reward players for their time, regardless of what they choose to play. With such a wide range of things to do in GTA Online, we believe that increasing these payouts will allow people greater freedom to do what they like and get what they want faster. That's also very awesome. Bodyguards, associates, and MC members will see payout increases to encourage and reward cooperative play, along with increased GTA money payouts across a variety of activities, including greater payouts across races, adversary modes, and select heist finales. Plus, our continued commitment to specially curated seasonal events Additional bonuses and gifts, community challenges, and other surprises for players will ensure that Los Santos remains as dynamic and unpredictable as ever. I'm very excited to see what that means. Are we going to finally get some construction sites finished up? Yeah, that'd be pretty sweet. But man, that's very exciting. Looking forward to this IAA mission set that we're going to be getting. The expanded versions of executive biker gunrunner and nightclub owner stuff so that'll be really cool to see and of course better payouts for races adversary modes and everything that's really cool as well it'll be interesting to see how much more but i'll always take some extra gta dollars and of course i mean the biggest thing i mean it's got to be said where is it i passed it already this stuff right here nerfs to the oppressor more convenient way to get snacks and armor equipped and to be able to sell anything in invite-only sessions. Thank you very much. That is lovely. Woo, I'm already excited. I can't wait. So, as I was saying in the stream that we did with GTA Plus ending June or July 18th, I'm assuming that's when this IAA update comes out. So, very excited to see that and get some new stuff. Hopefully we get some new vehicles and everything from that as well. But it is sounding awesome and cannot wait to see where GTA Online goes, especially with this ever-evolving and dynamic, unpredictable Los Santos line here. I'm very excited to see what that's going to be about. So with that being said, hopefully you guys have enjoyed taking a look at what's coming to GTA Online.